In this video, we're gonna compare the Logitech MX Master 3S to the Apple Magic Mouse. These are two fantastic mouses that are both great for using with Mac OS, but there's some major difference between both of them. So in this video, we're gonna compare the pros and cons of each and the different scenarios in which I would buy the Magic Mouse and which I would choose to buy the MX Master 3S. The Magic Mouse is Apple's native wireless mouse that integrates perfectly with Mac OS, and you can control all the different functions of the mouse directly through the Mac OS system preferences. There's also no scroll wheels on the Magic Mouse, so you can do vertical and horizontal scroll both just using your finger on the top of the mouse. And so it's a really enjoyable, smooth, fluid experience using the Magic Mouse with Mac OS. The MX Master 3S is a completely different mouse experience than the Magic Mouse. It's much more ergonomic and it's raised quite a bit to give your wrist much better positioning than when you use the Magic Mouse. You also get additional buttons on the side, a button that you can use on the top scroll wheel, as well as a button below the scroll wheel, and you also get a side scroll wheel on the side of the mouse. There's physical left and right click buttons on the top of the mouse, so there's no multi-click gesture on the top like with the Magic Mouse, but you also get a special button where your thumb rests on the side that allows you to activate some of the same gestures to switch between apps and to activate mission control, just like using the Magic Trackpad, or using the Magic Mouse. So it's cool that Logitech was able to build that into the MX Master 3S. With all these additional buttons on the side and top of the mouse, you can also download the Logi Options Plus app to change what these buttons do. And it's really cool because they allow you to have both general buttons and also to change what the buttons do when they're open in a specific app like Final Cut Pro or Photoshop or Excel. So you get a lot better productivity options using the MX Master 3S than you do with the Apple Magic Mouse because there's some of those application specific shortcuts that are easily accessible with your fingers. The way that you pair these devices is also quite a bit different. With the Magic Mouse, you pair it to your computer using a lightning cable. With the MX Master 3S, you flip the mouse over and you press the device pairing button and it starts to blink and then you're in pairing mode. You also get three different slots that you can store devices in. So to change from one device to the next, all you have to do is flip the mouse over and press the button and you can go between using your computer, your tablet and your phone or multiple computers really easily. Another huge difference between these is the MX Master 3S uses USB-C to recharge and the Magic Mouse uses Lightning to recharge. And unfortunately you can't charge and use the Magic Mouse at the same time. You have to flip it over on its back like a turtle and plug it in and leave it to charge. But with the MX Master 3S, you just plug a USB-C cable into the top of the mouse and you continue to use it even while it's charging. The MX Master 3S is also a little bit more expensive than the Magic Mouse and it's available in black, pale gray, and graphite and the Magic Mouse is available in white and black. So the MX Master 3S gives you a more ergonomic, better for using with multi-devices setup and the Magic Mouse gives you a device that feels a little bit more premium and it also just integrates with Mac OS a little bit better, but at the cost of multi-device support and ergonomics. The Magic Mouse is also quite a bit smaller than the MX Master 3S if you're traveling a lot and you just wanna throw it in your backpack, but Logitech also has a smaller version of the MX Master 3S that's called the MX Anywhere 3S. That's a little bit better for travel. So if you're trying to choose between these two mouses, I think there's a couple things you should consider when you're trying to decide. I'll buy the Magic Mouse if you want the seamless Apple experience and you're mostly doing browsing and basic productivity work that don't require as much customization or as good of ergonomic comfort as the MX Master 3S provides. I would also buy the Magic Mouse if you want a portable mouse that goes in your backpack a little bit easier. But I would choose to buy the MX Master 3S if you want multi-device functionality, better ergonomics, customizable buttons, and a USB-C connector on the top instead of using Lightning. If you're interested in buying either of these mouses, I have links to buy both in the description below. If you have any other questions about these two mouses or you think I forgot something, leave a comment down below and I'll do my best to answer them. Also be sure to check out my dedicated reviews of the MX Master 3S and the Apple Magic Mouse in which we go into even greater depth on both of these mouses.